Kia ora, my name is Joseph Munson. I study Creative Technology and a Bachelor of Marketing and Advertising. So my background from where I'm from, I come from the Māori North, Matauri Bay, which is in uh, the Bay of Islands. I'm, of course, I'm half Māori and my other half is uh, Danish, so I come from uh, Denmark and also from um, Norway as well. Uh, from my perspective on what culture means to me, culture um, means that, like, with me personally, I wear it as like a as, as ink. It's a whole entire cultural, um, spiritual, and emotional um, um, aspect uh, that I take from our family and our from. Um, our queers and uh, our, from our whakapapa as well. We tend to walk around with pride uh, rather than walking around with staunches um, thinking that we're, um, we're better than everyone. So basically what I'm saying is that walking around with pride um, is how a Māori person and a Māori student operates. Bonjour, my name is uh, Laurent Antenchak and I was born in France and now I live in New Zealand. So I'm half Kiwi, half Froggy. Culture, uh, what is the definition of culture? It's a um, culture, I think it's a, it's the, the big sticker for um, knowledge, for context, and for probably the location where you come from. And in France, it's more, um, people are more uh, looking backwards and looking more at history and sort of uh, conventions and sort of heritage. Which is good, but sometimes it just locks them down to a very specific mindset. Because uh, there's a lot of social classes in France. Here it's really Pacific based culture, uh, and it's also very Asian, because we're close to Asia, because of the Pacific zone. It's more uh, uh, refreshing than in France, I find, because uh, people are more open to uh, novelty. Uh, New Zealand uh, made me a better person. Surprisingly, <laughs> if you think, if my students think I'm tough, <laughs> I was even worse. <laughs> my name is John Meredith, and I come from Samoa. New Zealand, in 1952, I didn't find any difference because I'm a town boy. I first arrived from a hardware department Worker to work on a, on a farm up north and then came down here to Auckland and the trams were the best thing I've ever seen in those days. But apart from that, it's no different from the life in Samoa I'm used to. In my opinion, as young people, if they get rid of 70% uh, of the custom and just give 20 of it, it'll be, that'll be it. Because they, you know, the, the old days are gone. You know, the old days, the old people are dead. And it's a new generation for young Samoans, it's like that.